Hey y'all, what's up? Um, sorry, that was really bad. I'm sorry. I'm really, really sorry you had to see that. Um, I just don't know where I am today. I'm just not in a good mood. I'm just in a hyper mood. I'm not in a bad mood. Anyway, um, so I'm on my webcam again today. Again? Again. Again today. Because I like making everybody angry because no one can hear me or see me well on the webcam. But it's a better angle and it's easier than holding my flip cam like this. Um, yeah. So <laughs> today I want to talk about registration for classes. Um, if you are in college or you know somebody in college and they are not going to be a senior, then you have probably either know the troubles or have heard about the troubles of registration, especially if they are a psych major at a really small school. When psych is a very popular major and they don't have enough classes to go around, so even though you're going to be a junior, you can't get into anything you want. If you couldn't tell, I registered for classes yesterday and um, I didn't have such a great time with it. You would think that by now I would finally get the classes I want, seeing as how I'm going to be a junior, but no, no, of course not. Of course I can't get into everything I want. Like, the psych department is like crumbling at my school. Not really, but just some professors are leaving and it's, things are getting screwed up and moved around. And so we're getting like new professors, so they had to like change the time to some of the classes, but I didn't know they changed the times, so I had my schedule figured out. And then I went to register yesterday, and oops, the times have changed, so I couldn't get into some of my classes because they conflicted. They were at the same time. So I like I was trying to figure out what to take, and I got closed out of still a bunch of class, a bunch of site classes. Um, and like I went to get signed into one of them, and the professor who's so nice, and I'm not like it's not her fault. She's like, I can't sign you in yet. We have to wait till all the site classes are, you know, like. We have to wait till registration's over to make sure all the other site classes get filled up before we can add extra people in to already, you know, filled to capacity classes. So I was like, well, okay. Um, but the thing is that, like, it's, like, a really confusing thing. But, like, I didn't know what to do because it's not a matter of, oh, you know, I'll just sign up for this class, like, some random class, and then in case I don't get, I'm not able to be signed into the other class, I can just keep that because... Like, it's this whole big thing, I'd have to drop one class in order to get another, but then if I don't end up getting the class I want to get signed into, then I'm, like, up a creek without a paddle because the spots in that class I'm currently in will go away. It's just really confusing, but anyway, I think I figured it out. Um, so here are my classes for next semester, unless something were to change. On, sorry, I had to look at my schedule, I forgot what I was taking. So, um, I am taking Intro to Accounting on Mondays and Thursdays from 3 to 4.15, um, it is required for my minor. I'm not excited about it at all. Um, I don't really do that kind of stuff, but you know, I'm sure it'll be okay. Like I'm relatively good at math. Um, and then I'm taking history of traditional Europe on Tuesdays and Fridays from 920 to 1035, which actually sounds interesting. Um, it fulfills like one of my humanities requirements and, um, my global awareness requirement. And, um, it's basically about, like, ancient Rome and ancient Greece, um, mostly, and, like, other stuff, too. Um, but I find that really interesting. And Lily's in it with me, so I'm sure it'll be cool. History classes are fun. Um, so those are the two not psych classes I'm taking. When I'm taking three psych classes. I am taking Physiological Basis of Behavior, which is basically what it sounds like. It's, like how the brain works and how the eyes work and how the ears work and all that stuff and with respect to like how like how you behave which is good it's cool because it's kind of like what I want to go into I want to go into like behavior analysis so I feel like this will give me some background when I'm in grad school I don't feel completely like what am I doing um and then what else what other psych classes am I taking um I'm taking abnormal psychology um Oh, physiological basis of behavior is Mondays and Thursdays from 135 to 250. Um, then I'm taking, what is it, abnormal psych, which is 1045 to 12 on Mondays and Thursdays. And then I'm taking personality psychology, which is like 1045 to 115 on Wednesdays. Um, but I'm excited, you know, like the class I'm trying to get into is cultural psychology, and if I get into that, that is from 1210 to 125 on Mondays and Thursdays. So then I would drop physio because then I would have four classes in a row on Mondays and Thursdays from 
10.45 to 4.15. It's five and a half hours of straight class. I can't do that. So I would drop physio and take that like another semester because I'd rather take cultural than physio at this time in my college career. So yeah, that's what I'm taking. Um, you know, didn't exactly work out the way I wanted it to completely, but I'm cool. It's good, you know. Like, I'm okay with it. I'm, I'm getting requirements done, which is the important thing. Like, you know, I'm not taking the exact site classes I want to take, but the classes I'm taking, I do have to take eventually anyway. So I'm just kind of like completely going outside of the schedule I had set for myself. Um, that's okay, because all the classes I didn't take this semester, I'll take another semester. Like, I'll be fine. I'm just exaggerating. I'm a drama queen. Don't worry about me. So yeah, um, let me know in the description um, if you are in college, what classes are you taking? Um, if you are no longer in college anymore, um, what classes did you enjoy taking in college? Um, if you're not in college yet, um, what classes do you like in school now? I just want to know. Somebody leave something in the description. Talk to me, please. I'm here. You're here. I love you. Bye.